YouTube, what is up with y'all today? This is Neil Goodfella, Goodfella Neil. I got another sneaker rotation here for y'all today. Man, just feel like I ain't, I haven't done a sneaker rotation in like a few weeks or something. So, uh, but whatever, you know what I'm saying? Like, this is what I wore, whatever. Happy it's another like sneakerhead weekend and stuff, man. Definitely uh, been doing what I do. I still been wearing kicks, you know me. So, um, jumping off into Sunday, they end up wearing the Shaq, the Shaq Attack. Um, some people probably wondering, like, um, you know, if you've seen my, like, my last sneaker rotation or two or whatever, he's like, dude, like, why are you wearing the same kick or whatever over him? Even just, like, wearing them twice or whatever, like, now or whatever. Um, or, or kind of recent like that well number one I just feel like wearing the shoe and number two it's just good to kind of like uh, break in the shoe you know wear it a little bit more often so it won't like fall apart I strongly believe in that you need to wear your kicks so they will not fall apart and uh, me I haven't added too many kicks to my collection this year but uh, man like just even wearing these shoes like once a month or whatever is still not good enough to me you know what I'm saying? Like, you got to wear them more. So, just so they'll last. So, the Shack Attack uh, Jersey uh, Edition Brick City. Um, Y'all see the color? This is what I wore for Sunday. <clears throat> Monday, I end up wearing these. The Chicago 9. So, I just want to definitely get my wear out of these before they drop them again. And everybody's wearing them retire them like my metallic fives back there i don't know if y'all could see that back there but yeah um because everybody gonna be wearing them and all this stuff man i ain't saying it's like the hottest shoe or the hottest jordan all the time but it's the og colorway and when they come back out i got a strong feeling people will pick up and be wearing on these again so <clears throat> tuesday i end up wearing the nike air tech challenge 2 crazy fly fire i love this I love this model in general so like you know I man I just got a bunch of colorways of this shoe really and uh, yeah man model is crazy even the third model that's crazy too but I wish they would have came out with more colors for the third model like they did with this one like they just spoiled us with crazy colors for the AirTech Challenge 2 now these shoes you know they came out 2014 um, when they was like really really out and they start coming out with multiple colors but uh, usually this is my spring colorway, but <clears throat> I just felt like wearing them or whatever, like with the kind of clothing I had on that day, color clothing and all that, the coordination and all that crap. But yeah, uh, definitely clean, definitely fire, and definitely one of them uh, models at least you should have. There's so many colorways out now, well, that came out before, uh, that it's like, man, just pick, just pick a colorway. But yeah, these... You know, I like these before I even found out they was even like a signature shoe. So, if these was at Payless, I would have picked them up. Of course, it would have, you know, I wanted it to look like this and stuff. I definitely would pick up. And, uh, yeah, crazy, classic. And, uh, yeah. And I wore these, man, because I thought I was just going to, like, just do an all Air Tech Challenge week or something like that. Air Tech Challenge 2 week. I mean, yeah, I, I, I really mess with Tech Challenges. So, Agassi shoes, Andre Agassi shoes, his shoes look nice, you know, and this is the second one. So, this is actually an OG colorway of the AirTech Challenge 2. Um, I think the last sneaker rotation I wore this one, uh, my lighting was kind of off because I did my sneaker rotation at night. I shouldn't have did that. I didn't have no natural lighting like I got now. Natural lighting is obviously the best, to me preferably. And man, this one... This one right here is clean, man. <clears throat> a little tight ass hat, man. <laughs> but uh yeah, these are called the clay versions. Kind of remind me of a little bit of NYX with that pop of orange on there. But um the, the blue is not navy, it's more so like a a, a dried up kind of like blue. With like I don't know, man. The 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 camera's doing a good job though as far as like picking the color up, but yeah. It's not nothing that's like, you know, home run you know like oh hit out the park kind of like shoe 
you really got to be into you either into this uh, kind of color or not most specifically though if you into this model you know that this colorway is definitely a must-have so um, yeah man I love it man I like it I see a lot of people probably might not too much care for this shoe or whatever because of the color or whatever but hey man that's how you know I still buy what I like yo even to this day but yeah nice cop so Sunday Monday Tuesday Wednesday 40s Wednesday Wednesday Thursday I ended up wearing the military blue four yeah I had to break this out this was definitely a classic crazy fly all that um, not too much to say about it other than that it's starting to yellow a little bit yellow not even a little bit but actually a lot compared to because I actually bought these brand new in 2012 when it was the year of the Jordan 4 to 23rd year and uh, that Nike Yeezy 2 had came out and that's where that whole um, Yeezy jumped over the jump man it's like but the military blue 4 drop and you drop like the black solar reds or some shit from uh, Yeezy 2's or whatever so like of course that shoe looked better than this and too that shoe was like limited and this was like everywhere so that was kind of unfair but anyway <laughs> I mean, I just, because I never too much, never really got that. I mean, you know, this man really, you know, Jordan's selling like a quarter million of shoes damn near every drop or something like that. And, you know, only just like, you know, maybe 20,000 pair of Yeezys drop or something like that. And all of a sudden it's just like, you know, if it's limited, no matter what, what you sell or whatever, if it's hyped and then limited on top of that, then yeah, you know, of course it's going to be held in a higher but anyway, that's another video. But yeah, so I wore the military blue joints. A lot of people forget about these, but they're going to be sucking back on the tip of this toe box once the Nike Air come. Uh, they drop these again with the Nike Air on the back. I don't know if these dropping soon or next year or whatever, but man, I still wear mine like normal. You know what I'm saying? And that vintage yellow, like I welcome the aging process. But I kind of been on the fence about, sometimes I wake up and be on the fence about just actually making this back all white again. It'd be crispy white. Now, in general, this shoe was never, ever, even outside the box then, it was an off-white. You know what I'm saying? The Mars 4 from 2012, Jordan 4 from uh, 2012, the Mars Jordan 4, that was actually white. Now, this is off-white. So, I don't want you thinking, like, age made this, like, tan because, like, it, it came out the box like that. The only part that really aged was this rubber cap right here. And that's probably due to oxidation because I actually let my 4 sit out, so... Uh, with the exception of my Columbia Blue Force, but I need to clean these up though. Anyway, enough of that. Friday, I end up wearing the Flu Game 12s. Definitely one of my classics and favorite Jordans of all time. One of my favorite Jordans of all time. Number one, it's like a childhood kick. Number two, I seen him actually play on TV at this time, not on YouTube and all that. This was like late 90s, so. And uh, man, I actually had this shoe as a kid. And then with this shoe, you could damn near wear with anything. So, um, but nice, subtle, classic. Got that black. Uh, you know, my girl like to call these the armadillo shoes, but you know, she finally came coming around us to twelves. But she she still don't too much care about the whole black and red. But yeah, it's classic, classic, classic. So that's what I wore for Friday. Saturday, I end up wearing my Nike. Hirachi utility joint crazy classic hopefully y'all seen that um on feet and uh yeah man thanks to everybody that's been rating commenting subscribing and liking and all that stuff man this is nail goodfella here goodfella nail with another sneaker rotation crazy i'm out this joint peace